Now, as you guys all know, Odorfest is a uh, nonprofit organization. Most, uh, aside from operating costs, almost everything that we make goes towards charity. So, this year our charity was the Alice Community Health Center, benefiting health, housing, and food programs for those in poverty or in crisis. Now, uh, pretty much all of our um, events, ha or and just you know, if you're going in and out of a uh, vendor hall, you would have seen donation boxes, and uh, we have counted up the total. Yes, we have. And just to remind everybody what's going to happen today is we set a fundraising goal of $5,000. We hope that we could get there with Maid Cafe, Charity Auction, uh, Cards Against Odafest, our amazing sketch drive, many other initiatives, uh, some of our fun games in the family and uh, festival area outdoors. Lots of fun stuff to do this weekend. So we wanted to raise $5,000, and if we did, we would do uh, inspired loosely by our friends at SCT with uh, Late Night Dog Fight. We're going to do it horribly, but shout out to you guys for the idea. We are going to do a hot pepper anime dub for you all, if we get there. So... Are we gonna do it? Let's do a drum roll. What right. did we raise? What did we raise, guys? Okay, ready? Yep. All right, so together we as an Oda family raised $12,033. 12 <laughs> $12 yes! $12,033. That is crazy. And 30 cents. <laughs> Thank you to that person who threw in the 30 cents. <laughs> but, um,. So anyway, we will have our stage hands help us get some chairs up on the stage here for our next event. We are so grateful to you guys. You are generous. You are supportive. We know that you spend your hard-earned money to come and buy a pass and enjoy our festival. And so for you to reach into your pockets and into your hearts a little bit deeper and give to charity, we always are so grateful to that. Um, so I know the Alex will be so grateful for all of this effort and energy. So here we are. We got one of our emergency management staff, Jay. Jay! <laughs> with uh, the most disturbing accessories in the world. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, we got our line control head, Patrick. Mr. Patrick. <laughs> we have fellow unicorn Tia. <laughs> we have vendors coordinator, Jessica. Volunteer coordinator, Mr. Vern. And finally, you. <laughs> Will you hand out your paper towel? <laughs> Introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Ryan. Yeah, there you go. I figured, oh, I'll just give you the no? donors, so that's fine. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen, all right? Uh, each of these five lovely staff members is going to ingest. Six. Six staff members, sorry. <laughs> Six staff members is going to ingest a very, very spicy pepper. Don't, uh, don't bring out the peppers. Now, uh, Jay, what is your normal spice tolerance? Uh, burning and uh, I can't say the other thing. <laughs> okay. It has to do with a body part. It has to do with a body part. Uh, Patrick, I think your mic is on, so. Nope. Not? Oh, there it is. It is now. Okay, excellent. Uh, spice tolerance. More than white person. <laughs> so, so like, like slightly more than ketchup. Then. Yes. Okay. All right. Sorry. I haven't done this before. Oh no. I've never eaten peppers. Ooh. Save me now, please. <laughs> oh. All right. Distribute the peppers, I guess. Oh no. Uh, Jessica, spice tolerance. Oh, sorry. Uh, tears and sweat. Okay. <laughs> you gotta like uh, Indian curry. Indian curry? Yeah. Oh, this will be a cakewalk for you. That's all good. That's all good. So while we distribute these peppers, we'll explain a little bit. So we have selected a clip uh, from a popular fun anime uh, that they have a script to, and they each have a character assigned. They will need to articulate and follow along and make sure they get in the lines that they're supposed to get in, all while fighting back the tears from their burning fiery pepper breath. So uh, at a baseline, we have some, uh... Ryan, why do you have a jalapeno? I don't know. No, 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 come back, come back. Come no, no, back, no. give uh, another one. 
so no one gets them. That's <laughs> weak sauce. No, no, not jalapenos here. So I think we got some habanero, some scotch bonnets. Uh, we might have snuck a ghost pepper in there. Who knows? Who knows? Oh, no, we might have dipped some of these in some secret spice. Uh, there might be some yo, tricks guys, up our sleeves. Do you guys like that show, uh, uh, Hot Ones? Uh, I may or may not have bought a, brought a bottle of The Last Dab as well, so we'll see. Anyways. All right, so we'll let you guys take a seat in your chairs so you don't have to stand there this whole time. Okay. I'm going to give up uh, my mic so you have three to share. All right. Um, but first, can we count them in to consume? Okay, get cozy, get cozy. Yes, we'll have three mics. Yeah. M math, math. All right. All right. Okay, so thanks to you, our staff, for our 20th anniversary charity punishment have gone above and beyond. I'd also like to shout out our info booth volunteer, Sophie, if you're here. Hi, for <laughs> Hi Sophie. Hi. <laughs> Sophie actually transcribed this whole video for them. So thanks, Sophie. You're awesome. All right, guys, let's count them in from the count of three. Then you got to eat that pepper, and we'll get started. All right. Drum roll. Okay. Let's get them counted in. And then we'll roll their clip. Three, two, one, eat! Remember to chew, and you must swallow. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I believe we do have... <laughs> I believe we do have an assistant here to help with some milk. But they don't get it. They don't, they don't get their milk until they finish the clip. Start it now. So start the clip. Start it. Uh, uh, uh. Please enjoy. Read, read. How the roux is a very thick. And there's lots of. The meat is mutton. It has a stronger flavor than lamb, I guess. The peas have removed the gamey odor. Odor. The tears are blocking my vision, sorry. <laughs> my cooking has left its mark. This is holy. Okay. This is just like a nurse. A curse on you. They're out of sand. Well, let's try. <laughs> what? what is this? <laughs> oh. Dried out stick, you can barely understand anything he's mumbling. I know that's anything that's happening. He's not understanding. You can do so. Kung Fu movie. Ah! Oh, this distinct fragrance. Oh, it is like a dish. <laughs> Based on Sichuan Love Village. Yes, yeah, Sichuan. <laughs> Diwang and Peony Root. The force of no, a direction. The, the dish oven has a legend that a traveler on the verge of death and instantly recovered upon tension. Oh, I see it now! Uh, earlier she was sleeping with spices. Yes, that is her specially. Aretta Hiyasako is an expert in medication cuisine. Medical cuisine is the marriage between food and medicine and pharmacology. Based in an Eastern medicine, it seeks systematically to provide nourishment. And the body is a steamed herbs. The other is more medical cuisine. I don't want to ditch it to the four herbs I had in the other day of this! And the death of the fragrance! Wait, not yet! Uh, what? Uh, she still has lines, I think. Oh god, now that you mention it, the main components of medicinal cuisine are that different from curry! Yo yo is tamric! Daikuyu, whatever it's Saranise and Shokyo is fennel! All the essential is curry! <coughs> we'll get there. <laughs> All the other battle! It's not my turn! <laughs> <laughs> Swallow! <laughs> she decided to capitalize on my little curry! She decided to do it like me. I can't. Uh, she decided to capitalize it on my. Uh, 
Uh, uh, the words <laughs> on the screen I can no longer read. It happened last time. Uh, thanks, thanks What's for the four substance to quotation. I became all warmed up the moment I had a spoonful. Uh, yes, uh, medicinal cuisine is formed to warm one's organs, heartens one's spirit, and eradicate all evil from one's body and spirit. <laughs> the way you maximize the fragrance of balance is the umami. <laughs> it's so perfect. This uh, dish far ah! surpasses anything a student could ever hope to make. <laughs> oh, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for you. That's not my for you. All for you. There is actually drool on my script. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> it can't be. All the judges should have bewitched by my curry. Gulp? I don't know how to practice either medicine for generations. I'm gonna pass out. Oh my god, I don't believe you do not deserve it, sir. <laughs> 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 are fine. <coughs> yeah, they're fine. All right. Oh. Well, guys, this is what we do for charity and for you and your entertainment. You guys. All right, team, you can you can get off the stage. We have more milk and other things as well as cupcakes and bread back there. So uh, save yourselves. So I need to carry the Tums. I lost my script. I don't know where it is. Oh, crap. Alfred, lead me. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Is that my thing? Do you know where my script went, anyone? Not that one. No. Steph. Steph. No, I don't need it. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> All right, guys. So, I want to, we also have our emergency management team standing by behind to help them with their pallets. Hello? Hi. Uh, he's got a bottle of Pepto-Bismol. That's, uh... Ooh. Yummy! 